first miss in the shootout. He was miles off his line. The card who can't believe it. It's Sheremy now for Cameroon to give them the advantage to make it 3-2 in the shootout. And Sheremy scores!
esperienza è un problema però non si è bello farli perché si può anche sbagliare in ogni caso il camero vince ancora 3 a 2 ai calci di rigore dopo lo 0 a 0 dei tempi di volazione supplementari i rigori di
Present, hoping to see his countrymen win the prestigious African Cup for the fifth time. Security levels are high here in the international stadium, as are the spirits in this football crazy city. The Pharaohs will have to do without superstar and Spurs striker Mido after his bust up with coach Hassan Shiatid, quoting that Mido is like a son to him. Six-month fan still stands. We still got a lot of international players on the pitch, though, especially those playing for the Ivory Coast. This is Drogba, Conor Venture Kalu from Paris Saint-Germain, Arsenal's Ibuwi and Kula, Egypt. And Asaki is through, but he's got it wide, Saki can't control, he's shot properly to the relief recipe for success, that won't help them much.
www.ghana2008.tv Highlights of the final of Ghana 2008, the 26th African Cup of Nations. The reigning champions, Egypt, taking on the indomitable Lions of Cameroon. Bosni Abrabu drawing the first save of the match from Carlos Kameni before Jeremy did likewise at the other end. First, and then again, the Cameroon shot stopper doing brilliantly against the Al Ali striker. It was scoreless at the break. Cameroon looking to sit back and hit on the counter attack. They were soaking up an awful lot of pressure, and Hosni Abrabu almost broke the deadlock in the feet. There wasn't much he could do as Hosni this time headed against the base of his upper closer, and then finally it came. Tenacious harassment by Mohamed Zidane squaring the ball to Mohamed Abu Treka in the 76th minute to slot home past the hapless Kameni, abandoned by his defence. Indomitable Lions threw everything forward looking to take the match into extra time. And El Hattery stood firm as did the Egyptian defence. Egypt make it six African Cup of Nations wins. They defeat Cameroon by one goal to nil. Good afternoon and welcome to Angola for the final of the 2010 Africa Cup of Nations. Bye bye, When he lets fly with his left foot, he is very impressive. That's a young guy outside. Feel. 
them for himself. A bit of a hesitancy. Oh, he's buried it in the top corner. I thought for a second, you know, he put that over. Oh, this is awful, isn't it? Didier Yacone, what drama. 12 penalties taken, 12 penalties scored. Can Yacone keep his nerve? Yes, he can. It's 7 6. That's the area where they like to put them. This is getting tougher and tougher. Yeah, this is missed by Chizan Balugu. They've lost, and Ivory Coast are celebrating. I hope it was an encouraging word from Didier Drop to collect his thoughts. Any penalty now could be the winning moment. Balugu has to score. And does. It is 7 all. He's giving it the same as Mawini did. James Carr have yet another marathon penalty shootout in the Africa Cup of Nations. The players that were left on the field. Scott has got to take a penalty. It's Carlo Torre. Now Carlo Torre likes to smash them. Javini has another player that hasn't taken one yet. He scored in the 2006 final, Carlo Torre. One of only two Ivory Coast players who did score in a 4 2 loss to Egypt.
Hey!